uh, and YouTube and all these different medias, I think society is fragmented into hundreds of different segments. Yeah, and now how, how does that impact design? Well, I think that, uh, like I mentioned before, it has a lot to do with age. Uh, I think that uh, people of a certain age don't want the dark, dark colors. And you tend to not want what your parents had. Yeah. You tend not to want what you've already had. Let's say you had a white kitchen. Well, that's the last thing you want is white again. You want to go right. darker. Or if you had a dark kitchen, you want to go lighter. So you want to feel like you've made a pretty big change uh -huh. uh, because you want to notice that you've done something, you know? Yeah. Um, so, yeah, people yeah. tend to go opposite of what they've grown in uh, this whole uh, urban, 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 urban thing. thing. Uh, people that are very urban, uh, downtown, they want the high tech, they want the sleek, the contemporary. That's the last thing they want is traditional. I know. Just west of Georgia Tech and west of where uh, Atlantic Station is, that's all being redeveloped. Because yeah. it was old, decrepit, industrial, yeah. warehouse, warehouse, and now all that's being redone. So that's going to be the new in-town renaissance, is that near west side just west of uh, Atlantic Station. We draw from Buckhead, we draw from Vining, Smyrna, Mableton, and then south towards Cascade Road, from. million dollar neighborhoods, and uh, tr old traditional, um, and then young, upscale, urban professionals. We're, so we really kind of are in the middle of a, of a real yeah. diverse uh, demographic.